Hi guys, welcome back to SRE Customs. This is Mr. Grady's uh, 30.5. It was a 30 degree north 29 that he sent to me to get ready for racing. So it had been run, but it not just broke in by the looks of it. So what we did was uh, we put a plus two crank in it, um, lightened and balanced the flywheel, new seals, uh, vented his uh, clutch bell and lightened the clutch bell, uh, full uh, uh, race porting, an ADA head with a custom made dome because ADA hasn't had domes in. Uh, they were unavailable and when I uh, got the email they said they didn't know when they would be available. Um, I don't know how long his recoil is going to last. They don't look too good. Um, but I'm going to get it out and get it fired up here the next couple days, get it running, uh, make sure everything is good. Um, I showed the porting on it in the last video, so if you want to see the actual work, go back and check it out. Um, but it should be a nice piece. Uh, my buddy Tim, uh, that does the really, really hardcore uh, machining that I can't do, that I don't know how to do. Um, he helps me out with that, and he completely made a dome for this because ADA, like I said, didn't have any in stock. So, you know, thumbs up. Thanks a lot, uh, Tim. You're the man. Um, <clears throat> now, um, I, ho I hope he does a good, uh, you know, I'm going to do a couple of heat cycles on it, but... Uh, I think uh, three heat cycles and then put it on the ground and, and you know, start uh, racing and having fun. Uh, go with a rich tune, 32 to 1. Um, I've run C12 in it. Um, it is uh, 17 to 1 compression, so there's a lot of compression there. Uh, you know, I did not advance the ignition timing. I left the ignition timing alone. Um, I, for ease of starting and stuff, um, you know, I don't want to kick it back and break in recoils. So, uh, there you have it, man. It looks pretty kill, I think. Um, I cut the, the shroud around and set it over the, the heat sink. I like that. I still want all the air directed over the fins. Um, I don't know what else to say about it. Just a good looking engine and I'll get it broke in for you. Um, oh, a couple of, I got a couple of questions recently about, uh, what's the difference between a bash mod and a drag mod? And to tell you the truth, it's the port timings, guys. Um, we make the timings more high RPM oriented for drag racing. Um, so the tuning window, in other words, where it, it wants to be you you've got to be right on with tuning and it operates from 10,000 rpms to 17 7 18,000 a stock engine or a bash mod operates from 8,000 to around i don't know 15,000 somewhere in there uh with less compression and opening the exhaust port later uh so i hope that gives you a basic understanding of the difference um basically the drag mod is is for wide open throttle it is for not no letting on off part throttle it's full throttle okay guys uh you have a, a great day this is sre and i'm out